So today's the day. I think I'm going to change out that electrolysis tank. And it is uh, pretty old. I haven't used it in a little bit. But I'm going to show y'all how to uh, how to set one of them up and what the uh, what everybody does that they shouldn't be doing. So I'm going to turn you off and get that bucket and, uh, and I'll show you what we need. So let's just unhook everything. Get this bucket out of here. This is my old setup. This is the graphite I was using. And I'll use that again. I'll just let it dry out. And it's been in this bucket setting for a while. So what we need to do is get some fresh clean water. Okay, we got our clean water, as you see. And we got our graphite pieces in and we got our jumper wires going across to each piece now what we have to find is something to hang our parts on so uh, let's see I know I had a piece of it. this is what we're going to use piece of rebar a lot of people use the rebar as their sacrificial piece of metal which is this graphite right here I find if you use graphite your water stays a lot more cleaner just works better for me so I'm gonna turn y'all off and uh, if I can't get it set up well now what we're going to do is put some uh, super washing soda, sorry about that, into our bucket. And I put a lot usually. And then we're just going to stir it up a little bit. Get it good and mixed around. Get our parts. Hang them like so. And then I uh, take the the negative. Just clip it right there like so. And then we gotta plug our battery charger in. Kind of rough with the. Uh... We'll let her go all night and we'll turn it back on in the morning. 